In this video, you will learn about named entity recognition using Spacy in Python. A named entity is a real world object that has assigned a name, for example, a person, a country, a product, or a book title. Spacy can recognize various types of named entities in a document by asking the model for a prediction. Let's import Spacy. Import Spacy. Let's create an NLP object and load the Spacy English language model. I'll make an object NLP. I will call this Spacy class and from this I will call the method load. Inside this I will pass the English language model name and the model name is en underscore core underscore web underscore sm. Let's execute our code. And if I call this object NLP, you can see we have this English language model at this memory location. Now let's create a document variable and call the NLP object and let's pass some text into it. I'll make one variable doc. I will call this NLP object and inside this I will pass one sentence. Apple is looking at buying UK startup for dollar one billion. This is our text here, and the text is Apple is looking at buying UK startup for dollar one billion. Let's execute. And if I call this object document here, you will see we have this text here, and in this text, you can see we have different uh, entity here. So entity is Apple because it is a brand or a company. Then UK it is a country. Then we have this dollar one. Dollar is a symbol, and we have this one which is a number. So we have different entities in this one sentence here, and we want to extract this using this spacey. And let's do that. Before extracting the entities, let us also print the POS tagging that is the part of speech, and also let us tokenize it. So I'll run a for loop on this variable doc. I will write for token in doc print. First we'll tokenize it. I will write token dot text and then I will put one symbol here to separate the token and the pos tagging and then we will write token dot pos underscore. This will get us the part of speech. Let's execute our code and here in the output you can see on the left side we have the text and on the right side we have tokens. So for Apple we have proper noun is, is auxiliary looking verb at buying UK startup for and so on. Here, here we will notice that dollar is a symbol and one is a number. So these are the tokens and these are the part of speech tagging. Now we are going to find the entity and we are going to visualize it. So for visualization, we have to import one library that is display C. I will import that library from space C import display C. And this library helps us for the visualization. I will call this display C dot render and inside this I will pass our document object doc that is this this object in which we have our sentence and the next parameter will be style and we want to get the entities so I will write ENT and then I will write Jupyter is equal to true and let's execute our code so here in the output you can see we got the entities here and here the entities are highlighted in different colors. First we have this apple and then it is given the description of this entity ORG it means that apple is an organization. Then we have this UK and it is also saying that organization but it is a country here. Then we have this dollar 1 billion and which is money which is correct here. So we got this uh, entities here for this sentence this apple is looking at buying uk startup for dollar one billion and the these are the entities for this sentence and if you want we can also uh, extract something specific from the text 
let's say where we we say apple is an organization and we just want to extract organization from the entity for that we will write for entity in document dot e n t s so we are running a for loop on this object document and we want to extract entities only and then we will write the condition here and the condition is if entity dot label uh, these are the label this org org money these are the label and we are saying that if the label of that entity is equal to org then just print entity dot text so we are saying that we are running a for loop and we are saying that if the label of that entity is organization then only print otherwise don't print let's execute our code and here you will see in the output we will get apple and uk because it is saying that apple and uk are organization and here i have to write why here sorry my mistake and here in the output you can see we got apple and uk because we are writing a condition inside this for loop and the condition is we want to print only those entities whose label is organization and if i change it to money then it will print this dollar one billion only so i'll change this to money i will write money here and now instead of this apple and uk we will get dollar one billion let's execute our code and here in the output you can see we got only dollar one billion this is how you can extract entities from any sentence using spacey i hope you enjoyed this video if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel thank you for watching